building a computer from scratch day 22. First off, I wanted to say thank you for 8,000 followers on Instagram. I'm thinking of something special if we can make it to that grand old 10,000. All right, let's get to the video. Here, we are about 85% complete with the ALU. Since day 21, I have every component already here. I just need to wire things up. The new change in this video is add. I also added another MUX 16 so that we can switch between our AND and the add. This is vital. This MUX is pretty much what determines whether or not we are doing arithmetic or logic. So let's try adding. Let's do 0101 and 0011. So we have 5 plus 3. This time my binary is correct, unlike day 21. The output should be 1000, which is 8 thanks to our adders. What is helpful about add is that we can isolate a value if we would like. This is because a value plus 0 is that same value. This is one of the reasons we can 0 inputs. So I can put 15 here as input A, and let's say we have 3 as input B. If I enable the ZY pin, this will zero input B. So no matter what is stored in input B, it will just be zero until we turn this pin back off. So the output is left with whatever input A is. In this case, we have 15. We can do the same with input B, just zero input A with the ZX pin, but why might we want to do this? An example is maybe we want to move a number from register A to register D. We can do a few more things with the ALU in its current state, but until I add this final part, we're still limited with what we can do. With that, I guess I'll see you guys on day 23.